in the blue corner. Please welcome the fighter of to be shown boxing Kazakhstan, very fine, Nurim Beto! Lost to Kaysan by Sangurov in Ukraine corner. in July. The boxer of K2 promotions from Chernihiv, Ukraine, Dmitro Mitrofano! He's a popular fighter, Mitrofano. I feel a good fighter, challenge for a British title on one occasion against Ted Cheeseman. In the blue corner, the fighter from Kazakhstan with the record of 13 fights, 8 wins and 3 wins by knockout, buried by Nurim Betov. Twelve fights, eleven wins, one draw, and three wins are coming by knockout. Rated number fifteen, WBO. He is WBO Oriental Super Welterweight Champion from Ukraine, Dmitry Mitrofanov. <laughs> Referee three, Oliver Kudirov. Oleg Kudyarov, our referee. I mentioned he took on Kassan Bysangurov in his in his penultimate fight, his last but one. We were in better. I've lost in the first round, but Bysangurov, a former world title challenger, and he boxed in October. We were in better. Back in Kazakhstan, got a win. So he's in the white. Mitrofanov in the yellow and black as I outlined a, a wealth of amateur experience boxing in that Ukrainian setup when it was it was all conquering really they topped the men's medal table at London 2012 gold for Usyk and Lomachenko a silver for Rinchik who we'll see later on bronzes for Taras Lestyuk and Alexander Gavozdik Ukraine Ottomans were a real force in WSB Boxer York Hall actually, Mr. Farnov alongside Usyk and, and Lomachenko back in 2013. Looking to get on the jab early here. Down at Super Welter now, having been up at middleweight originally. And this was actually set for £152, so just wonder if he's inching his way down lower.
it's only a couple of fights ago that he decided that 160 was was too much but he could maybe go a bit lower by the look of him he's in good shape I'm not saying he isn't but it's possible better look at the combination there maybe the right hand just slid in a touch low this one's scheduled for eight two fights we've seen so far have both gone down the stretch over ten rounds swinging a big lead left hook there they're in best of right uppercut on the inside from Mitrofanov was a good shot trained it the boxing laboratory, I guess Klimas's boxing laboratory in Oxnard in California at the start of his pro career, Mitrofanov. Mitrofanov solid contact with the side of the head during Betov sets his feet and looks for a big right hand over the top he's come to mix it here I'm not sure how that's going to work out for him right hand again there just in around the back of the guard Lauren Betov sinking into the rope seemed happy enough to try and engage good first round entertaining opening three minutes And it's been good to see fighters like Norin Betov do what he's done during during COVID, which is to stop trying to protect that unbeaten record. He was 5-0, but he's 30 years old now. He wanted the work, he wanted the fights, and so he's been happy to step up and travel away from home, take hard fights. He's done it again tonight. Kicks off the round with a neat combination to the body there, and he's come to have a crack here. You can see that from the way he went about that opening round. That's what you want. This just makes a much, much better viewing. Fighters willing to roll the dice a little bit more, not caring about that O. Good right to the body again there from Nurin Betov. Treating to the ropes a little bit there, Nurin Betov. He's happy enough to do it. Right to the body from Mitrofanov. Stabs down to the body, then looks to the left to the head done that a couple of times now he just leans forward pours at the canvas with that back boot that right boot like a bull slightly Trafanov again with a short right they both just dipped at the same time there and then as he came up he just clipped him with the right hand there Mitrofanov I mentioned that WSB match at at York Hall which has gone down in British boxing folklore he actually beat Fred Evans that night Mitrofanov Team GB's London 2012 silver medalist good one too from Mitrofanov got the distance on that one spot on and stepped off to his left and threw a left hand Nurin Betov again just giving ground there going back to the ropes
long right hand from Mitrofanov and Norbetov just pulled away back there, managed to ride that one. Get the impression this could be a long eight rounds for him though. He's taken some some relatively heavy shots in this second round. He's always looking to try and fire back, but he's not really had any success in round two. Good jab there from Mitrofanov. Big right hand from Nuri Betov and Mitrofanov saw that one coming from a long way out. Blocks it with that left glove. That double left hand from Mitrofanov was nice and solid. Well, there's a conversation being had in the, in the corner there. I just wonder what's going on here. There was a slight gesture there from the, from the corner to the referee, and I think there might be a problem with the right hand here, and they might be about to retire their fighter. That's definitely a possibility, and the referee is signalling that the that the fight is over. I think it's a problem with that, with that hand, because you could just see that the trainer had made that slight indication to the referee there that his man couldn't continue. The doctor was called up to the apron. Words were exchanged. A little bit of a conversation, and after a couple of rounds, Nurin Betov has decided that he is best off not continuing. That's a shame because that was warming up. Mitrofanov, I think, will be disappointed that he's not going to get more than a couple of rounds out of this one. But it's an early night. It was scheduled for eight. It's over in two. I'm sure he'll be looking to get back out again in 2022 as, as quick as he can. So I think that's where the problem lies. Well, that's Mitrofanov. The pro problem lies with the right hand of the man in the opposite corner. He's just getting that right glove taken off in that blue corner, Lurin Betov. And they're trying to get that glove off now. They want to be careful with it. Maybe there's a, a break in there.